This video is sponsored by Juin Tech. Hey guys, Irene here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I have a really cool indoor photo shoot I did in my living room with model Sonia. We used the super small RGB lights, Juin Molus X60. This is definitely my smallest yet still powerful LED light I own. The kit I got comes with the mini diffusion dome, the battery, light itself, and the power cord. I did use this light for photo shoot, but of course it's still awesome for video. I'm using the X60 here to light up the background and one of my favorite things about it is that I can fully control it through my phone with the Juin app. So for the photo shoot, I really wanted to play with the RGB aspect of these lights, so we went all out with color. This was my inspo board that I sent to my model and I was also really inspired by Stormy who I fold for a while now and this artist makes really gorgeous art with flowers in a very unique way so I knew I wanted to incorporate that in some way as well. My first setup I tried was just a little bit too much. I had the mylar sheet that reflects the light in the way that looks like water ripples and I put one of the X60s pointed at the mylar sheet and then the second one on the other side of the model behind her to create a very strong side backlight. It was cool but ultimately it was just too much going on, too much harsh light for my liking so I decided to put a soft box on the main light and point it at Sonia and then I loved the way that looked. For the dress, I have this beautiful chiffon purple dress I thrifted a while ago. I wanted something light and airy and a bit see-through so that some of the light would go through the material. And then for the prop, I used this fake jumbo poppy flower I got on AliExpress. And by the way, all the links for all of the products that I'm using today will be linked in the description. And finally, we have a fan to add some more movement and interest to the shot. But if you uh, drop the flowers, have just one, and like really close to you, that just which way do I put it so that it doesn't do all the bangs funny, but still does look a lot. Maybe this way, maybe just this way. Just, actually even this is kind of cool, like you're standing like, like that, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's do some like more simple maybe with like you're just standing, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you can do that, that, you can like move around, maybe even kind of like, you know, kind of like this with it. Yeah, just kind of do your thing. Oh, yes, 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 yes. That's very beautiful. Oh, yes, I love that. <gasps> That's so pretty. Wow. Mm-hmm. Ooh. I love when it's like doing that to the yeah, I think this dress is perfect because it like catches the light. Ooh! Yeah, keep doing that, just kind of... <gasps> oh my god, yeah, yeah, just keep going like back and forth like that so that it catches the dress and... <gasps> oh my god! So just add the flower to it now in the other hand, in the other hand. Yes, 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 yes. And just a little bit higher, kind of like, yes. And just keep doing that kind of like back and forth with your shoulder, like back and forth, back and forth. Okay, stay like that. I kind of want to get this almost like shining into the camera. Uh-huh. Oh, maybe like more behind you. Okay, take a step like further down this way. We're gonna put this right behind you, kind of like this. Like really backlit. Whoa. Whoa. 
Oh my god, the way it's like illuminating the flower. This looks crazy. Okay, stay like that. This actually looks really, really good. Kind of want some of this hair in here. We're gonna make it just a little bit less. Yes, and just kind of look uh, to the flower. Yes, yes, exactly. Still like that, there's just like, needs to be like a touch higher. Oh, is this the highest it can go? Oh no. Just a little bit higher. Right here. Oh yes, there we go. Just. Oh, I want the hair to almost like go from maybe below almost. Doing this, I want it like to be like more fluffy. Oh, oh, <gasps> holy schmoly! <laughs> I'm dying. shoot I experimented with color a bunch I tried more pinky colors just orange green blue but the best combo was definitely the cyan blue with the yellow orange I also tried switching them around but it looked best when the yellow orange was the backlight and not the other way around it kind of mimicked the sunset and then the blue was just a really nice contrast to the yellow as they are on the opposite sides of the color wheel I also just love how how the orange bleeds into the blue creating that pink purple color in between but let me know what other color combinations should I try on my next photo shoot so this is like really close up get that really close to you the the rose or whatever that is yes and get like this just a little bit like this with your face Let's go back to kind of just doing that, you know, when you were just kind of posing with the, with the kind of like standing, yeah. I do really like the way it like blows this, yeah. Oh my God, how are like, they're all just like crazy? Wow. Seta Kamaya. Whoa, whoa, whoa. In the man ochi, in the man ochi. <gasps> wow. Ida ko chuchut, chuchut lutsam. It's so pretty. Okay, and I'm gonna try to make it just a little bit less 
powerful. <gasps> yeah, that's a really beautiful pose. I love that. Love it, love it, love it. Oh my god. Now, what if you turn even more so with your back, or like the other way, the other way? No, no. So the, yes, with your shoulder, but this side. Uh huh. Yes. Yes. By the way, if you're wondering how I fix the backdrop in these pictures, you can check out a tutorial I posted a few weeks ago. It's basically a mix of content aware fill and generative fill, so check it out and I'll leave the link to the video in the description. Wow. Yes, yeah, so I'm getting like really close to you, like you're hugging the, the flower, like real close to your face. Yes. Yes. And eyes at me. Wow. Whoa. I really loved the light that we created during this shoot and I definitely will do more shoots like this in the future maybe even outdoors with like spring flowers oh I think that would just be so so cool uh, let me know what lighting setup you liked the most uh, the backlight from the side or maybe fully backlit uh, with the light hitting the lens or fully one side lit with yellow and one side with blue I think my favorite was the first set of images but let me know what you guys think and if you like this video don't forget to give it a like and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next one bye